What the heck is up, my friendlies? I'm a friendly boy. Hey, Americans, what's up? It is I, another American. How can I say... We are gonna learn how to roll, but in German. I won't speak in German, of course, you silly goose, but the game will. <laughs> Alright, everybody, we're gonna play Learning to Roll. Now, as you can see, I've already got some previous numbers on this, but hey, forget about that, boy. It is time... It is time to roll. It is time to do our greatest. Fuck you! Uh, Alright, everybody. So how is it going? Yeah, you missed that Pokemon Let's Play? I sure fucking don't. Wee woo! I wonder, actually, man. Should I turn the volume up on this? I don't know. Is it coming through? Is it feeling like it's good to go? But alright, guys. What is going on? It is Monday. And you know what that means. It's time to feel really sad. About Monday... No, is that too loud? I almost wonder. That might be too loud. Haha, ha, just kidding. We don't need that volume. We just need me to go... Ooh! Oh! Man, I've been watching some, some Forbidden TED Talks recently. You know, uh, Forbidden TED Talks are the spice of life. That's, that's what all, the, that's what all the, the good boys and girls say. They say, boy, I watch Forbidden TED Talks. Oh no. Okay. Alright, we're good. So this is Marble It Up. This is a game on the Steam library there. Ooh, nice little diamond thing. And basically, Marble It Up is an old platformer that I actually used to play one kind of rendition of back when I was really young. When I was uh, in middle school, I believe, I played this game called Marble Blast Ultra for the Xbox 360. And that was back in the good old days, the golden age of Xbox. Of, like, I think, like, 2009, man. When everything was this group chat place, kind of, sort of, and everybody was on voice chat saying the, the nastiest shit to each other, but man, it was funny, it never became this big, dramatic issue of two monoliths going against each other, man, like fucking World War One, you know, you know, where every country is allied with each other, so a conflict that was once between two people suddenly becomes a conflict between, like, you know, eight countries, man, oh, yeah, that was the the wall the wall on high, and then this is uh, Super Jump, the first level that's going to show us about the Super Jump power up here. Hell yeah! So yeah, guys, I think you know uh, if this is going to be obviously a game that is in German, and if any of my audience here wants some sick German lessons online, then by all means, my God, dude. I think let's plays these days, uh, you know. They're trying to go into the direction of either doubling down on that sort of classical, like, good old humor of just being like a dude bro, like, you know, Super Mega or Oni Plays, or they're trying to go into maybe a newer direction of being this sort of, like, video essay podcast. I tell you, man, what if I give you Let's Play slash Tutor Session, dude? <clears throat> like, the good old tutors. The, to the tutors who have the pooters. I don't know what that means. But yeah, man, I uh, feel like Pokemon is definitely like this hard let's play to like keep up with because holy moly, um, there is so much off-screen grinding you have to do, and because there's no way in hell that I would want to do it like on screen, right? Because that would just be so fucking like tedious. And it would be so monotonous to be like, oh, we're in the Route 118 Wild Grasses again, fighting a fucking Raticate or whomst <coughs> ever. Yes, that is right. You heard that cough right. I, uh, I don't believe I have COVID. <laughs> Next week, s small YouTuber barely, barely noticed by anybody dies of COVID-19. Nah, but no, seriously, um... Ah, uh, fuck that shit, dude. Um, our country has responded to this disease so terribly, and I have nothing but contempt and disagreement for how we've gone about it. Um, and I think, you know, we need to have... We, we should have been much more serious about this a lot sooner, and we shouldn't have been so corporate about this. We should have had people staying at home and being paid for and having their living afforded to them instead of being like... Work for the capital! Gah, 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 gah. You know, that's, that's bullshit, and that's fucking bullshit, and I hate that. Um, I don't know if that gives away my my perhaps left-leaning <laughs> politics. Maybe more left-leaning than that, but yeah. Um, Whoopsie-daisy, here I go crazy. Ooh, ooh, the 
music changed. Oh my. Oh. oh, fuck, yeah. Oh no! Oh god, okay. Oh no, are we headed for a transition soon? In the next few seconds here? I. 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 <laughs> All right, it is back. But yeah, I feel like this is, you know, the fascinating thing about this game is it's it's very nostalgic. Um, and to a degree, I don't know what this game is going... Apparently there was, like, some, like, ambition, ambitious talks a while back about how the people who uh, had to, who had much to do with this game were talking about making a mobile game for this that had a multiplayer feature. I don't know. I don't know how they were trying to do that, man. I feel like that would, uh... That would that sounds so messy to me, because you know mobile games are obviously usually pretty bad, because they're free to play, pay to win, and you might think at a at a noob's first glance that that free to play is pretty cool, because God forbid like the barrier to entry is even at the level of playing, right? But the problem with free to play, pay to win, as many of you may know, if you're fuck. <laughs> The problem that many of you may know, if you're if you've been on the internet for a while, is this shit can get pretty stratified. Free to play, pay to wins suddenly start to turn into like games that become all about just appealing to the rich kids to having them win. So, great. All right. Oh, this is so much fun. This is this is a fun one. Although although if you can survive that okay ooh ooh oh oh god okay ooh i like this song here yo okay can i just say the music from marble blast ultra is really fucking cool and it's really nostalgic and i don't know you can't necessarily top that it's a whole other fucking world um but this game's song for marble it up is uh this game's songs are not bad either they really, they really take me somewhere, you know? Marble it up, multiplayer. Oh no! Haha, -ha, you can't fuck me! You might try! Oh wait, hold up. Alright. I'm the ball! I'm the one who fucks you! Okay. Oh no. You know, for once, I don't like playing with bumpers. Because, <laughs> you know, I'm really bad at... I'm really bad at, um... I'm really bad at bowling! <laughs> oh, this is so much fun. Oh! Oh no. Oh! This looks like... I love, like, the sort of, like, just surreal cosmic look of this game. Like, it looks like... Like the mappings of like outer space on a grid with like relative or theory of relativity and gravity and like the fundamental forces of nature and shit, but like you know, still grounded within some kind of planetary environment. I guess in that sense, uh, if you are a, are a well-traveled journeyman of video games, you may know that I'm not super against the aesthetics and looks of a, a Japanese game by the name of Katamari. I feel like that's a fun game with that sort of fun cosmic look to it. But, um, I'm also, like, really bad at Katamari. <laughs> like, holy shit, I'm so bad at Katamari. Um, and, you know what, that's okay. It's okay to be bad. You know, I feel like, man, you know, YouTube's, YouTube and the internet recently have gotten so corporate, and it's like, people just want to see people being, you know, like, hyper-confident at shit. And that's great if you're hyper-confident, man. More power to you. But, like, hot diggity damn. Like, can we go back to the good old days, bro, where people were just like, Oh my god, I'm so bad at this game I found on Newgrounds Media. I mean, you know. Yo, does anybody remember Unfair Platformer? I feel like I should play Unfair Platformer. Take it back to the to the good old like 09 days when people played fucking Unfair Platformer and New Super Mario Bros for the Nintendo Wii, dude. Oh yeah, okay. Oh, is it time for another transition? No. 
Not necessarily. Okay, wow. So yeah, I'm taking my little sweet little time on this level. I know, I know, right? It's already been a fucking minute. I am not, not doing super hot. Oh, wait. It is there! I see it! Oh, no! Alright. I should probably just use... Oh, that did fuck. That did shit for fuck, dude. Alright. Oh! Oh. Well, here's the fascinating little thing. Apparently, on the Nintendo Switch subreddit, of all places, about a year ago, they said, Marble it up to add multiplayer in upcoming Mayhem update. Also, over 30 user-created levels. This game keeps getting better. Didn't know it existed for Switch. Oh, is this just coming to Switch? Bro, I have a Switch. Bro, I play Animal Crossing. I just have no recording software for that game. I could... Oh, this is so much fun. Oh, this le Whoa! I can knock the clouds away! I forgot I could do that! I, like... Oh, man. You definitely could not do that in Marble Blast Ultra. <coughs> oh, wow. Wow. Oh, yeah. Oh, dude, this is so relaxing. This fucking song. You know what? You know what? We're doing that again. We're doing that again. We're turning the music up, and we're just chillaxing, dude. Can we chillax with just game and no commentary? Bro, let's find out. Is this too loud? Is this too loud? Can you hear me, Anakin? Okay. You know what would have been the meanest shit is if that, like, if I didn't make it at the end there and just bounced off. You know, I'm gonna be honest. If you were watching and that's what you were hoping for, uh, I'm right there with you. That would have been funny. Yeah. Uh, oh, God. Okay. Oh! 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 Let's go. Oh. That's a cute little thing over there. Oh, yeah. You know, I should totally do, like, a Fall Guys Let's Play since everybody's doing Fall. SHIT! <laughs> Ich weiß, dass ich weder war benutzen soll, aber ich bin nicht klug. Um, let's see. Uh, wow, we daddy. Uh, yeah, I know. I don't know. I don't think I would be very good at Fall Guys, but maybe. That's the point, gamers. Okay. Oh. What? Ah! Oh God. Yep. Yep. Travel on the platforms to the higher to the higher platform. Yep. All right, I got my spicer punked. My spicer punked. There we go. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. Okay. Oh yeah, dude. I'm gonna show you the power of luck that comes from going to all these when you don't have a quarter on you. <laughs> I know, uh, apparently, so there's a timer up here, by the way, in the game, but you're not seeing that, so you just magically see whether I make on par time or not. Aw, uh, yeah. Did I make on par? I don't know. Let's see. 110? Then I'm here. Okay. I mean, I didn't get fucking... Wow. How did I manage to get, like, a bronze copper medal? Jesus. Jesus, gamers. That's some shit. Alright, so first we go and get that pause medallion. Okay. Now actually, I think last I checked, this level was, like, kind of hard. Here. Meow. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Man, this game is so pretty. How the frick? Okay, I swear, when I played this level one time ago, some time ago, <laughs> uh... Many a goes in the past time, I had seen that over there you could like scale the thin platform 
and get around this, and that is what I recall with, oh god, oh, oh, oh this song's changing to something dumb, it sounds like the beginning of a fucking pretzel commercial, watching the Super Bowl by yourself, <laughs> in this pandemic, anything's possible, that's why you should order from Philly Pretzels, I don't even think the local Philly Pretzels is in town anymore, did they fucking go out of business, bruh? Oh, man. Is it time for another transition? It might be time! Oh, it might be time! <laughs> oh. Oh. You like that transition? You like the look of the waves just rippling across my video? My video clip sees? I put three periods. That's an ellipsis. Oh, yeah. Bro, this song... Actually... Actually... Straight up, even though it sounds like a bit of a gaudy pretzel commercial, I don't know. I think I dig this song, dude. Yo, marble it up. If you're looking to, uh, if you're looking to make a small YouTuber's day really well, or actually, I think the phrase is just make your day, just period. If you're looking to make a small YouTuber's day, uh, hit me up, dude. Um, <laughs> make my day. <laughs> all right, all right. Yo, I'm a phoenix. Oh God. Oh, 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 mama. Okay. Spicer punk. Spicer punk syrup disaster. <laughs> Hell yeah, dog. Do 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 do. All right. Later, gingerbread. That's what you call people instead of sleepyhead. You say later, gingerbread. Uh oh. 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 Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Ah, uh, there we go. Oh, I like how like the area around it got really dark. Like, cause it was like, it was like a the dark cosmos, dark night of the cosmos, dude. Okay, so apparently I know how this goes. You're supposed to actually kind of jump over to each other ledge every so often. That's over to the left, because the ledges on the right here will like keep like fading away. I think. So. Oh God. Bro, I have to say this song is really fucking good. I don't know what it is, but like I swear, like listening to synthwave and vaporwave mixes like all week long um, has like doled out my senses to like that sort of like retro futurism kind of music but this thing this is good oh. all right now we're looking by the way i'm thinking of ending this first part <laughs> gamers um after i do the i want to say after i get to the second or third like world because i know i started this off as you can see with the with the first world there with the learning to roll level Red platforms move on their own time? Yeah, thanks. I know. Sweet. Alright. In the elevator. In the elevator, gamer. Elevator. Alligator gamer. Alligator gamer. You ever run into a gator who's a gamer? He's a gator gamer. Gator gamer, dude. Fucking hiccups. My hiccups are terrible. Hiccups are terrible when you have some kind of cold too, That because then it's just like, you feel like it also is like a little, it's like way worse, because then you also have obviously that, that cough, that cough rotted throat, and you're like, oh, wait, am I, am I going the wrong way? No, I'm not. No, I'm not. The goal's right there. Okay, cool. We're good. Yeah, I feel like that Planet vs. Zombies Let's Play, man, is for like me and my, me and my girlfriend, so it's like, oh no. <laughs> it's for me and my boo, you know? Now, here's an epic question, gamers. Should I play, like, Minecraft, or should I not play a game that would just be really, like, boring in terms of, like, actual game skill? Because Minecraft is mainly a creative's uh, wet dream, and that's exactly what I am. I'm a creative. I have no analytical thought process power whatsoever. Uh, oh, no. Oh. Oh. Yes! <coughs> And I feel like I would just get so fucking lost in Minecraft. I would just get so lost in the sauce. 
Does anyone else feel weird about, like, making videos about being on a Minecraft server? Because then it's like, oh god, you're recording other people. And they're not real people, but it's like... It feels like they are, you know? Okay, this song? I like this song. Oh, this. This looks like some shit. This? Oh my god! They don't stop being icy! Ho! Ho! Okay, that was by the skin of my coccyx bone, dude. Which is really sensitive and vascular. Okay. Oh, man. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, man. Are we going to get a transition here, gamers? Okay. Yes! I'm going to have to turn the volume down. I am clipping the mic like a Tyrannosaurus clipper. Gamers. Alright everybody, this is my favorite song. That was did that transition cut me off too bad. Oh I love the blocks. Oh wow, such wonderful design in this game, I swear. There I need to like do a part where I just admire Where I just honestly fucking admire this this fucking world. Would people love it if a guy just fanboyed out over some indie platformer game? Bro, honestly, you know what's weird about games these days? Why are indie games just, like, code for, like, platformer or sex game? Like, I don't know. Like, I'll go on the Steam library and I'll be like, yo, what are the indie games these days? Because I'm thinking to myself, I'll be, because, like, I don't know. Hear me out. I do get that, like, indie is, like, adventure platformer. It's, like, code for adventure platformer, right? But it's the weirdest shit, because then I'll be like, okay, well, you know, what's up with that? Like, uh, let me, let me play some fucking, what, what's the... What's the famous indie platformer game that's got really big? Was Tora Dora? No, wait, that's the anime. Oh god. What was the famous indie platformer game that's called, like, Tora Dora, but not Tora Dora? That one. Gamers. You know what I mean. Oh no! Oh my god! Yo, the stop sign should totally not be translucent, thanks. That should actually be, like, that should. Uh, wait, was I going the wrong way? Wow! This, uh, really sucks, huh, gamers? Okay. Alright. Call me Matthew McConaughey. Because, uh... I'm about to be McConaughey! Hey! Was it a bad joke? Was it a bad joke? I'm, th I'm sorry. Were you looking for, for high-quality, highbrow humor? Because, uh, mm, You done, you done, you done missed. Oh no. Oh, I got the, I got the Spicer Punked! Sweet. I wasn't sure if I got it. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. Y'all, honestly, how fucking trippy would it be if I had a German Oblivion Let's Play, but just like still with English commentary? Like, bruh, frick, dude. Oh. Yeah! Time keeps on slipping, slipping, slipping into the future. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. No no no. No no no. No no no. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. 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 Alrighty, boss. Is this what? Hold on. I gotta get out of here. What level are we on? Like if we go to level select, we are on Oh, we're on chapter three! Bro, we're on chapter three, and I know you cannot see that right now because you're only seeing this like bottom part here. You, you see enough to see the go, and uh, my recording software is right above the game where it says what actual chapter that is. We are on chapter 3, so we're on world 3, so holy shit, um, I guess never mind. I have to say, this game definitely has a lot more of a gradual difficulty incline than like Marble Blast Ultra, so like that's definitely, I think, an improvement in the level design, because obviously, if you're playing this shit, and it just cuts to like level 10 difficulty like a lot of what Marble Blast Ultra did. I can totally see how that's like a pain. I think this game is definitely a lot more forgiving than Marble Blast Ultra. Um, and like they were actually just trying to like get, it seems like they were actually trying to get like more of just a crowd and less of just uh, trying to be a challenging uh, platformer game. But my god, I'm still blanking on what that fucking platformer game was called. That was like the something something game. It was it was like I played it. It's like it's like it looks like almost like a Dark Souls game but for platformer. It's called it's not Toradora, but it's something. 
Dreams Tour Door is an anime about a guy with beady eyes and a blonde chick who's uh, tsundere, <laughs> which is supposed to be cute, but I I don't have the social wherewithal for tsunderes. I feel like if a girl is like, mean to me, I would just be like... I feel like it would be very entitled of me to be like, oh, maybe she's just a tsundere. Maybe she, maybe she just likes it. Maybe she'd like it if I'd, if I'd, like, make a move on her more. Like, no, that's how you get, like, thrown in jail, right? Like, uh. Oh, God. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no! Wait, wait, do we? No. Oh, wait, no, no, no. Oi, frickin' Vey over here! We got a transition again, boys and gamers! Hey, everybody. Don't mind me. I, uh... I'm just still trying to Google what this fucking game is, but my phone moves at the uh, speed of 10 miles an hour. So that's a shame. Indie platformer adventure game called... Dora Dora. Let's see, will we will we ever know? I swear I remember what it was. It was like it was literally hold up. Is this cringy? Is this cringy gamers? Cringy trying to jog my own memory here? Oh yeah, dude. We're we're traveling through the fucking Hooten Mifflin reading comprehension textbook, my dude. Welcome back to fourth grade. Can you put the fucking correct articles together? <laughs> Bobby ate bread. Ate the bread on Saturday, dude. Oh no. Oh, this one this one's like open. Oh, okay, kinda cool for landing there without dying okay. Alright. I look up this and I fucking come up with Celeste. You know, I was actually gonna try to do a Celeste Let's Play, uh, but, eh, I don't know. Also, wait a minute, hold on. I could- MOMODORA! That's what it is! Holy shit! Okay, so, hold on. I'll definitely have to lower the volume on that clip, because I popped the mic. Oh my god, that's what it is. It's MOMODORA. It's MOMODORA. I literally have my Steam library open right in front of me. I could have just looked at it. Hello! Yes, it is, it is, it is MOMODORA. I like me some Momodora. You know, the last guy that played Momodora got into some really hot trouble. F uh, wait, no. Let me, <laughs> let me rephrase that. Oh, God in heaven. I didn't mean it. Um, he got into some really hot water. He got into some bad, 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 bad controversy. So I think Momodora has been tainted. And we need someone who uh, is not just in, like really not good, very bad water, um, like, in a particularly... I'm, I'm too small of a YouTuber to get into details, but let me just say, uh, you know, I'm not looking to get in trouble like that guy anytime soon. So, let's play some Momodora, yeah? Let's play some Momodora and avenge the Momodora world. You fucking Momodora piece of shit! Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh, yay. All right. Oh, this is a uh, Sanrad, I believe. Maybe. Okay. There's a really crazy one that I want to try at some point where like you're just on a series of moving islands and you have to like get off of them at a certain time. Oh no. Okay. Whew. Oh no. Oh no. Tell my wife I love her. What wife? Uh, sorry, I didn't take my thyroid medicine today. Like that makes any sense. Uh. Oh no. Oh no! Oh no! Okay. Let's do. Oh no! Okay. Oh, come on, I gotta get the spicer punked! The spicer punked! Okay. Oh no. Oh no! Hey, I got this the spitcher the spitcher punk. I got the spitcher punk, dude. Oh, I like this song. It sounds like a fucking like poppy radio love song, like mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. When 
I was young, I was on the radio. She said to me, do you like Marble It Up, yo? I said, hell yeah. You want to play Dungeons and Dragons? I said, sure, I'm a magician. So she said, I'm a dragon, sorcerer, mages. Getting it on in the break room. Flipping pages, rolling dice. Aw oh, yeah, I'm a level 10 group of mice. What do we do? We're trapped in this hellhole. All I have is a bag of rice. Oh god. Oh god! Okay. Whoa! Ah! Ah! <laughs> Where was that going? Was that going anywhere? I don't think that was headed anywhere. Okay, a pair. Oh my god. I'm t I, I was t in my haste, in my arrogance, in my eagerness. I have merely accelerated my own demise. Uh. <sighs> well, the ending's right there, as you can plainly see, but... We have to make a transition! Oh. Alright. Back from that scary transition. What in the world? Oh, wait, I see. There's another gear over there you have to, like, jump onto. Okay. Let's do it. Oh, no. Oh, n oh my god. Okay. Okay, and would you look at that, dude. With epic sonic speed, uh, I am real in to go. Wow, this looks bumpy. <laughs> looks like it's gonna be a bumpy ride. Oh, wow, this is some sick drum and bass song they're playing, are they? Bro, come on. The music in this game is so good. Who makes this? Solovox. Solovox? No, not fucking... No. I'm... Oh, God. What have I done? Hold up. Wow, I've just ruined. Uh, I'm trying to go to the options to lower the... Or raise the music, dude. Okay, everybody, welcome back to the gamer party here. I'm your host, Ryan Sierra, and we are looking good. Just avoid the bumpers, gamers! How? Man, if I was on a fucking face cam right now in the top right corner, dude, you'd see me bobbing my head. Like I'm bobbing for apples. But I'm really just bobbing for some sick beats. Oh, oh god. Oh god. Okay. You might think I'm doing a Canadian accent or something right now, eh? But actually, uh, I like to call it the free healthcare accent. I like to call this accent free healthcare. Oh god. Oh god, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Sweet. <sighs> Yeah, guys, I fucking, I fucking hate the way this country's gone about the pandemic. I know. No politics in these videos, gamers. That's that's rude. But gamers, I think we're under attack, because if we have to go out to work in the middle of a pandemic, and our livings are not afforded to us, and we have to go out in the middle of a pandemic and face a disease to work, instead of having our lives afforded to us, then gamers, we can't stay home to play epic games. So, like, we're under attack by conservative corporatism, gamers. All right. Boom, 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 ba dum, ba ba dum, boom. Oh my god, I love this song. This is this is such a fucking fun game. I don't understand. Like, I know I love those slower pace games too, like the action adventures, like Witcher Three and stuff. But like, my god, dog. Like, I'm, I'm just, I'm so enraptured. Also, is that a is that a horseshoe? Ah, shit! I thought I wasn't gonna get any more political than I had to, but no, there's fucking horseshoe theory, chilling out, chilling out in the pool over there, the pool of the cosmic jacuzzi that we all live in. Oh no. Okay. All right. I believe. All right, cool. I'm actually. How far? How far am I into this? Hold up. So we got a level selection here. Um. I'm on chapter 4, and I'm on the third level. Gamers, I think this is probably a great time to, to make an epic pause. So, 
that's exactly what we're going to do. In part two, we're going to come back and we are going to go through all of it. We're going to get through, hopefully, uh, the rest of this game. In the meantime, here's to cringy outros. Hey, what's Black Squad? You want to play Black Squad? Hey, gamer. Gamer! Gamer! <gasps> Giveaway! That's not a scam or anything. This is an outro. This is an outro. This is an outro.